Hey Shalise, I'm just going to create a quick video about some edits to the Birch Creek maps. So first of all there's some South Creek watershed overview maps that we can make some modifications to. So right now um, if we look on the screen here we have the perennial uh, streams within the South Creek watershed. I'd like you to add the intermittent uh, layer as well. And so this will um, fill in these uh, discontinuous uh, channels here. Also, if you can label um, the streams just by stream name, that would also be useful. You can also add the road layer from AGRC. And these will mostly just be dirt roads so I can symbolize them. I'll pull this over to kind of show you what I'm thinking. So this is just um, from ArcMap, a view with imagery, and then I've added the intermittents and added the road layer um, with labels for the streams. So this can kind of be a guide for that. So all this base information that I've talked about can be added to um, each of each of the maps. So a couple of the things that I didn't mention are there's a lake layer. I think that'll help fill in some gaps. And then also adding in um, the zoom extent for the more detailed maps. So basically this rectangle area. And you have it on the other uh, maps. So this should be, if that's added, that'd be very useful. So looking at, at these following maps, these will all have that new base information. I think it's going to really um, help add some important detail to each of these maps. So these subsequent maps we're looking at will have the new base information. Um, note that Josh has rerun each of these RCAT tools, so there's a little bit different data. So if you can coordinate with him, that'd be great. And now looking at more of the zoom in, so here we have the the index map that shows that zoom in area. So that's the thing I'd like added to those South Creek maps. And what I'm thinking on the on the zoom ins of if we can just label um, Birch Creek here, I think that might be sufficient. We could look at maybe adding the road layer as well. See how that comes up. So it'll just be that road right here. And I think that might be useful to have. I'd like to create one more map. And so you'll see kind of the series of maps of RCAT and, let me go the other way, sorry, RCAT and BRAT. But I think one other map that would be useful will be just the valley bottom. So there's a new valley bottom. Um, that I created. It's called Valley Bottom underscore WM and that's kind of a more refined Valley Bottom and so that could be added to the map. So hopefully this is enough to get you started. I'm sure you'll have some questions but um, you know once again there's some new data runs from Josh so if you can coordinate getting the new data and then um, so I guess these uh, graphics are going to change as well with the new data so why don't I check in with him and make sure we have a final version before you get started. But, um, you know, here's, here's some of that information. Okay, thank you.